Hi everybody. Uh, today I, I will demonstrate my, my stretching routine. These uh, stretching exercises are best for uh, weight training. After kettlebell training or other uh, weight training, then the spine is uh, getting compressed. So these, these exercises a little uh, decompress the spine and, uh, and stretches the muscles, the back muscles, the glutes, the hamstrings. So it's mostly for that, and especially after heavy weight training or high rep uh, burpees or something like that. Um, each exercise should uh, you you should hold at least thirty seconds, maybe more if it uh, feels good, but at least thirty seconds. In the video, I will I will hold it uh, for shorter time, but. Uh, in reality, you have to hold it at least 30 seconds, okay? So this is the first. It's a yoga pose, it's a child pose. You have to be long and flat. You come forward. You don't allow yourself to uh, sink in your shoulder blades. You push yourself away from the floor and uh, tighten your glutes. Then go back and go to the right. Back again, front. Push yourself away from the floor. Go back. Then on the left. With each stretch, you should. Uh, you have to concentrate on. I'm getting loose, so relax your muscles. You can do relaxation while you exhale the best. Okay, so the next pose, it's a downward dog. It goes like this from the side. It's a very good decompressing exercise. stretches the whole uh, posterior chain. Okay. The next one is for the quads and the hip flexors. So the goal is here to go as deep with your hip as possible. Just sink in and let it stretch. You don't have to hold the heel close to the butt. The purpose is to lower the hip to the ground as much as possible. Okay, do it on the other side. Next one is a glute stretch. Put your leg across and lean back. And hold it at least 30 seconds, all the poses. Change sides. Ok, 
Okay, the next one is a very important stretch. It decompresses the lower back. So it's a, it's a rotational stretch. You lean back, elevate your uh, knees, put it down on one side, extend the leg, grab the big toe, and try, look the other way, and relax into it. Okay, the other side. So almost every time I do this stretch, I feel some relief in my back, maybe with loud cracks. It feels very, very good and it really decompresses the lower back. Try to relax in it. Okay, the last one is my favorite hamstring stretch. It's very good because it uh, keeps your back safe. So most of the hamstring stretches are some forward leaning uh, pose, but this one lying on your, on your back, it keeps it safe. So grab your feet from outside, relax on your back and try to extend your legs. Do it slowly, don't force it, just keep it and inch by inch just extend your legs very slowly and try to relax your hamstrings and hold it this particular pose i hold it each time at least two minutes Okay, so this is my stretch routine. I do this every time when I uh, train with weights, especially after kettlebells or, or swings or deadlifts, squats, because it, it really helps keep my uh, back, my lower back especially healthy. So try it and let me know. Thanks for watching.